everyone hello it is me vex and welcome back to another video um sorry it's been a while uh, my computer hard drive was broken and it took some time for it to get here but we're back and i'm back posting videos if you has <coughs> if you have seen if you have been in the discord you would have known about this um so yeah this isn't roblox studio world as you might notice this is actually pokemon scarlet and violet and all the pokemon all the new pokemon in pokemon scarlet and violet i thought it would be cool to make a pokemon scarlet and violet tier list as it's been 12 days since the new games has released and i have over 50 hours of gameplay in the game already <coughs> i've been playing a lot non-stop <laughs> so okay let's um start okay first we have sprigatito it's a solid starter i'll put it in there okay okay this thing that i forget the name of every single flipping time um expect me to not know most of these pokemon's mo um, most of the starters middle evolutions name because i'm bad with remembering bring pokemon names that i am new to okay so we have sprigatito's evo uh, i'm gonna put pretty cool it's the best it's the best middle evo this gen um most people will be like mm, it's bipedal i don't really care if it's bipedal or not bipedal well 90 percent of the time okay not 90 <laughs> like 60 percent of the time bipedal po evos do look cool and i think p people are of reacting um meowscaraptor i'm gonna put it in okay um the thing with this is they made it look too feminine which i do not like i'm fine with bipedal pokemon but i'm i don't like when they try to make it look like a specific gender like they did with meowscarada all right quaxley very epic <laughs> i love quaxley the moment I saw Quaxley, I was like, okay, I'm gonna choose this as my starter. Uh, Quaxwell was like, what the hell? <laughs> when I when I evolved my Quaxley and saw this thing, I was like, what? The hat, I'm, I'm not digging the hat, bro. <laughs> like, I, I think it's the hat, but it's like, it, it doesn't look good. Okay, Quaxgavol actually looks pretty good because um it looks like a brazilian um brazilian parade dancer which does not look that bad um it's a fighting type and i like fighting types <laughs> um i don't see why people don't like the design of quaxgavel um i think it's pretty cool like i can see how why people call it like a gay duck but come on it does look very feminine though which i do not like but i still do like it fuikoko is pretty cool <laughs> those eyes <laughs> look like me his face look like me in math class maths class i'm very happy on the outside yet clueless in the inside okay this thing <laughs> the egg hat I can't. What the hell? <laughs> it's just if we're Coco that's bigger with a hat. Like, what? <laughs> Skuldridge is. <coughs> I had a voice crack. Uh, <laughs> Skuldridge is pretty cool. I like it. Actually, no, I'm gonna put it okay. Mainly because I do not like the flames. The fire on it is not that good. Like, why is it a square square fire that's not a thing and personally i don't like how his head looks like what <laughs> and it's supposed to be a crocodile and they have like really long noses and stuff but i don't know why i think it's because it's too chunky looking yeah it doesn't look that good to me okay now we have lechonk very epic <laughs> that's the best name <clears throat> the best name this whole generation lechonk 
<laughs> it has to be very epic. Oink Loin, um, I'm gonna put it, it's okay. Personally, I like the male version better, but that's just me. Okay, tarantula things. <laughs> um, it's okay, it's okay. I do really like it shiny, which is like a black and red color, which is pretty cool. Okay, tarantula evolution is also an okay. <laughs> small live. Small live is pretty cool. I like small live. And the rest of its evos. I really like um this final ever though. It's like an olive tree. Which I think is pretty Claude Sire. Claude Sire is very epic. I never personally use Claude Sire, but I love that it looks like a blobfish. And even though blobfish are really ugly and make me feel strange and I don't know why. <coughs> I'm gonna put it up here because it looks really cute and derpy, like Quagsire should be. Okay, Paul Me. Paul Me is like okay. Same with Paul Mo and Paul Mot. <coughs> okay, Tandemus. Tandemus? Is this what the mouse is called? Or is that. I will never know. <laughs> Whole line is okay. I, I, I like, I, I would put in what the hell, like, waste of Pokemon, but I think the family aspect is pretty cool. And the only reason they're high up is because they remind me of Tenjin's mouse from Demon Slayer. The buff mice that are, like, okay, anyway. <laughs> Capskid. Capskid's weird. Is it a chicken plant thing? like it looks it has a beak it's an egg it's like a little baby dude and then it evolves into peppers <laughs> scovillian is pretty cool though i i do like scovillian and we finally have a grass fire type which pretty cool i don't know why people are hating on it like because it looks ugly it doesn't look that bad it's name is scovillian it's supposed to be a villain <laughs> Okay, now we got dice and chainsaw man. I'm I'm gonna have to put chainsaw man. <laughs> I don't know why I'm calling it chainsaw man because I don't know its name. Okay, <laughs> you guys can roast me in the comments all you want. I'm calling that. Oh wait, I remember your name. It's low kicks. <laughs> yeah, but it reminds me of some anime. But roller, <laughs> I forgot his name. Yeah, but his Evo line is just okay. Okay, the Dunsparce. The Dunsparce. Like, it looks cute, but if I if I did add a, like, in the middle of what the hell and trash can, I would. But I know lots of people um, really like the slim, sim, simplicity of the Dunsparce. But they could have done so much better. My hopes were so high for a Dunsparce Evo. Like... They could have done anything better, but all they did was just add more segments to the, the dance pass. Making two different forms of the dance pass doesn't make it any better, Game Freak. Okay. Now we have Flittle. And Flittle's Ever, which I'm gonna call Sussy Chicken. Um. <laughs> the reason I'm calling it Sussy Chicken is because I used one for a short period of time while playing it and called it sassy chicken and i have no clue what its name is <laughs> uh, i think it starts with an m but i can see the idea with it it's like a psychic golf chick and i like golf chicks <laughs> i don't know why people can't see that flittle is a chicken is a chick like it has a beak and it's small isn't that what a chick is? <laughs> now, I think if you have a beak and you're small, you're a chick. <laughs> mm. Okay, Wiglet. Very epic. Wog Trio is also very epic. Whenever the first second I saw Wiglet, I fell in love. I praised Wiglet. But then stopped praising Wiggler because I wanted to praise Lord Quaxley as he gave me better shiny luck. Shiny luck. 
Okay, now we have the Tinker Ton Tinker Tough line. I don't know what the baby is called. I don't think I've ever seen the baby. I have never seen the baby's name, bro. I think it's okay. Looks ugly. Same with this. But this this is pretty cool. I'm not gonna put it in very epic because I think it because in my opinion it's a little bit overrated. I mean it's very good, but it's overrated. Tinkerton with a huge hammer. Like say less. If it had a move where it's like four and it could like throw it and it would come back to him. That would make him in very epic. Okay, now we have Charodact. Charodact is okay. I like Charodact, it's pretty cute. Has a huge head, which is cuter, anyways. <laughs> Um, now we have Armor Rouge. Armor Rouge, Armor Rouge. I'm gonna put Armor Rouge in pretty cool. I chose Coridon. Um, cause I like, I, cause I really did not like Maridon and I still do not like Maridon. I don't know why, it just looks not nice. <laughs> Server Ledge is very epic. I used it on my team, like, after the age gym and it carried my team i named it asta and i loved it <laughs> someone traded it to me for my arm rouge and i have praised it toad school is very epic toad school line is just very epic toad school and toad school i love them <laughs> it's running animation is the best animation <laughs> Pokemon has ever made <clears throat> Like it's running on its two legs whoever came up with the idea of toad school and toad school should get seven raises and a half And plus their shinies are just so good All right now we have King Gambit which I also really like King Gambit. I used one in my team and I named it Hadrada after Harold Hadrada. I'm not a nerd, I swear. <coughs> it was just on my mind when um <coughs> when trying to figure out a nickname for my King Gamut. So yeah, it was such a good Pokemon with its um hidden ability. Wait no, I it, it didn't have its hidden ability. <laughs> Def I don't think Defiance is a hidden ability. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not. Annihilate is also very epic. The fact Primeape got this badass evolution <coughs> of a ghost fighting type. I don't think we have a ghost. Oh, wait, never mind. We have Marshadow. Yeah, but this is really cool. Like, the Primeape like, died or something. And like the chains being partially broken is also like really cool i love annihilate i never used one on my team because i already had um uh several edge that i was definitely gonna keep and i already had um Quaxcavor and a lucari on my team so it would like overlap with half of my team so i never used one but if i could i would <coughs> okay ferrigarath is pretty cool Actually, I'm going to put it in very epic, mainly because Verigraph was my first ever shiny in Pokemon Scarlet. Uh, I found one in Area Zero uh, by accident as well. I was trying to catch a random Verigraph and this random shiny giraffe rig got in my way. And I never, I didn't know it was shiny until I got into a battle with it. Okay, now we have the Wish Cash the bootleg wish cash the bigger chunkier wish cash it just looks like wish cash but bigger <laughs> like what it's okay okay now we have psychic steel fish <laughs> it's okay I, ne I never used it fins and fins and's pretty cool the first dolphin pokemon ever and it took nine generations just to have a dolphin pokemon which I think is pretty insane. Actually, nah. Because Japan's history with dolphins isn't the greatest. Palafin is just no. <laughs> I don't like. I don't like the, the 
I, I get it. It's just palafin with a heart. But then the hero form. Hero form is pretty cool. I think he should have just stayed. He should have just evolved straight into the hero form. Instead of having to switch out and switch back in for it to become a hero form. But it's good. Alright, now we have Tadabob. Tadabob is so cute. But I'm gonna put it in okay because I do not have a what oh I I didn't oopsie hold on can I make a new <gasps> wait I can add a new row wait I forgot I could do this wait wait a minute wait a minute cute stuff hey 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 had a bulb sprigatito so anything that's cute here I'm gonna just bonk up there. <coughs> <laughs> I want to change your color. There we go. Very good color to choose. <coughs> Alright, now we have... Wait, what was your name? <laughs> how, did, how could I forget your name? Oh, ha, ha. I forgot your name. <coughs> We're gonna put you in cute stuff. <laughs> Mr. Frog. <laughs> I never used you. Um, I barely even seen you. The only time I've ever seen this thing was in Iono's battle. Which it was really bad in, by the way. Okay. Varum is okay. Reverum. I'm gonna put Reverum in pretty cool. Because, um... Team Star using like a lot of rev rooms and var rooms to make the cool ass um, bus thing or their like battle car things. I forgot what they're called. It's like really cool. All form, all form, all form was a disappointment. All form needed an evolution. Game Freak knew that, yet still didn't give it an evolution. <coughs> Like, all forms should have had an evolution. I know all the Titan Pokemon don't have evolutions. But it should have. It should have. It just looks like it needs one. Oh, Setoddle. Setoddle is so cute. When I first saw it, I was like, what? This isn't Set Titan. <laughs> Set Titan's very epic. I love the shiny. Set Titan's shiny has to be... One of the best shinies Nintendo has ever made. Like, ever. Okay, Farigabax. is cute. Um, I'm gonna put you, I'm gonna put you pretty cool. And now Baxlabor, very epic. Baxlabor is so freaking good for the Elite Four. It can take down, like, three out of the four of the Elite Four. Because it has type advantage against it and can take down most of the... T it can take down three out of the four titans as well. Which is like really good. Baxlabor is a must have for your team. Even though it might be the pseudo legendary. <coughs> okay, Tatsushi. Tatsushi is another Pokemon that needed an evolution. Like the dragon water type is a good typing. But it really needs an evolution. I'm going to put all of them in cute. Um, I really like the pink one shiny. Where it turns white. Um, all of these different. All three of these forms have different shinies. Which I think is pretty cool. Um, Cyclizar is like. Okay I'm going to put it at what the hell. Like. Cyclizar is just. Like no one. No one's going to care about you. When we have the two better stronger and cooler versions of you like what's the point I bet someone's gonna comment oh but we need cyclers are so we could have the p past and future forms because kawaii don't and mawaii don't are paradox pokemon i don't care bro <laughs> i don't care cyclers are should have not existed all right now we have Bird. Bird is okay. I like bird. 
Bombarder, Bombarder. Bombarder is okay. Squawk's ability, Squawk's ability. Squawk's ability should have had an evolution. Like, <coughs> it really needed an evolution. Like, how about Squawk's ability evolved into Bombarder? How about that? <coughs> flamingo, Flamingo, Flamigo. I loved Flamigo. I had one on my team for the early stages of my Pokemon Scarlet journey. But then I found out it didn't evolve. And I was like really sad because I loved Flamigo. And I just sacked it. Because um, I already had like three different fighting types on my team. So I just got rid of it. I put it in my PC. I gave it its own little special box. But if I really needed an evolution, bro. I should have had like buff feet or something. Cloth needed an evolution. <laughs> Cackly, Cackly line is okay. Gargnacle is pretty cool though. <clears throat> Main because it's really OP with its hidden ability and like... It has a 500, 500 um, base stat total. <coughs> um, it's pretty good for PvP, I'm pretty sure. Like, it can't be... With its hidden ability, its stats cannot be lowered. And it has, like... Really freaking good moves. Okay. Um, you're supposed to be over there. <laughs> Wait, right, Glimmit Line. Glimmit Line's okay. I like its shiny. The shiny's cool. Okay, now we have you, <laughs> Grafii. Grafii shouldn't have been the final ever. Like I know sh it makes sense, but Grafii should have had another evolution, like Shrewdle Grafii, then I don't know, Big Grafii. <laughs> Fido, Fido's cute. I like Fido. Donut Dog is a it's okay it's okay i i don't it's just donut dog <laughs> all right you hands drift stay down there <laughs> wabo stiff bro the storyline with arvin and wabo stiff with the titans was the first time i cried in pokemon other than the anime bro like <laughs> if you watch the anime <laughs> You have cried multiple times, and if you have not, you are lying or you are just emo. <laughs> now we have, um, Tumbleweed. Tumbleweed, oh, not, not there. Tumbleweed's okay. Ghost Grass is pretty cool, but nothing special. Gimme Ghoul. I like Gimme Ghoul. I like his chest form more. <coughs> Gold Dingo. The fact it's like the silver surfer is like really cool. Like, but instead it's golden, golden surfer. Like, I I don't know why people don't like it so much. Great tusk, so cool. Brute bonnet, so cool. <laughs> uh, Sandy shocks is okay. Screamtail, why did you choose? Jigglypuff out of all the Pokemon you chose Jigglypuff Screamtail's okay though. Why do you choose Mistrivus? Why 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 didn't you just choose his evolution? That makes no sense. You give an unevolved Pokemon you give two unevolved Pokemon to Scarlet. That's like unfair trash can you too trash can failure silver window that's like pretty cool bro you are going up there i love roaring moon roaring moon's the best um paradox pokemon all right these what the hell like it's not even an elephant anymore it's tail is on is it's supposed to be his trunk but then it became his tail and his hair 
at the same time. Wait, what? It went on his head. Iron Fists is okay. Bro, like... <sighs> they didn't even try. They just made it more sharp. And, like, metallic. Like, what? Iron Fawns is cool. I, I, I like Iron Fawns. The thing they did with the Violet past poke I mean, future Pokemon, was they just made it metal. They just made it robotic. Like... Animals don't evolve into robots. That's not how it works. Like, what? Like, <clears throat> and so, a uh, deli bird. Like, what the hell? Why? Why deli bird? Like, look at this. Look at those feet, bro. Iron Galleon is pretty cool. Like, it's a fusion of Gardevoir and Gallade with its type of um fairy fighting i'm pretty sure <coughs> all right now we have these guys which um i only know this guy's name if i even get it correct pan chow <laughs> i know this guy's chili I, I i like the four legendaries this one's definitely going on the top like <coughs> a snow leopard with sword like epic moose pokemon i'm pretty sure this is our first moose pokemon it's pretty cool i i like it it's like a pile of grass but it's a slug i dig it it's, i i think i flushed this down the toilet once and i'm not even lying <laughs> cute stuff okay now with the legendaries Coridon, yes, Maridon, delete this. <laughs> it it just doesn't look good. Like Robot Dragon does not look good. Okay, well, I think Scarlet and Violet has unfair Pokemon in general. Like, look at this, look at this, mischievous, and um. What's it called? Jigglypuff? Hydreigon Tyranitar? <laughs> I'm pretty sure Hydreigon is Mistrevis's, like, counterpart. And Hariyama is Jigglypuff's counterpart. Like, what the hell? That's, that's not supposed to work. Anyways, this is my tier list. Um, hope you like it. If you don't, um, go away. I, uh, <laughs> I'm joking. Comment down below if you agree or disagree. I know lots of people are going to disagree, especially the PvP people. They're going to be like, uh, well, this Pokemon is actually really good because I have been studying him in Pokemon, um, what was it called? In Pokemon Showdown for the last 20 years. Don't ask how. I, I don't know. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm going to be doing a four hour stream on saturday so yeah look out for that i'll see you guys next time Pe goodbye